All right, we're going to go over how to clean your jacuzzi jets. If you have a jacuzzi jet, there's a chances are you might have a blower on there. Sometimes if your jacuzzi jets get uh, filled with dirt and debris, uh, which could happen because if you have jacuzzi jets, you can have a cartridge filter. Remember, when the cartridge gets plugged, it's going to bypass the dirt. If you're running the jets or you're vacuuming with your jets on, you're going to plug these up if your filter's dirty. So when you vacuum your pool, make sure your jets are shut off, first of all. Vacuum through your returns in the pool, not your jacuzzi jets. So you're going to have one of these two types of jets, if you look in here. They're going to be hard to see because they're going to be underwater on your hot tub. But this will be the first type. And basically, you're going to take a screwdriver. The wall of the pool will be right here. This part will be behind the pool, buried in the dirt. You'll take a screwdriver and pry this out. Now, under normal operations, this will be on, on, let's see, righty tighty, lefty loosey, on, off, on, off. If it just spins, it's not installed properly. So pry it out, get it off the wall, it'll look like that. Then you can take and unscrew it. When you get it out, it's going to look like this. Okay, and there you can see off, on. And if you look in here, you can kind of see the threads and what it looks like in the back. It'll actually be positioned in a hot tub like this with that hole up on the top. So you can kind of see here, that's what it's like when it's installed. That's what it's like when it's out. So you'll take this out. Turn the pump on, blow the lines out, clean this out good. Then when you put it back in, you got to kind of be a little bit gingerly about it. I'm right-handed. Get it like that. You got to be careful with these because if you push too hard, it seems like you're threading it, but you're not doing anything. Now you're not really doing anything. So what you want to do is just kind of get it in there gently, catch the threads. Now when you clean these out, you're going to pull them all out and blow them all out at once. Don't do it one at a time. Pull them all out, turn the hot tub on, blow the jets out, clean everything out, put them back in. When you're done, it'll be like this. Smack it, and you're good. The other type of jet's going to look like this. It's going to have these four nubs in there. Now... They do make a jet tool. You can see if you can get a, two screwdrivers in there and gently turn them counterclockwise, or you can take a piece of inch and a half pipe, cut four notches in here with a hacksaw crosswise, and use the PVC pipe to get onto that. So this is what it's going to look like when this one comes off. You're going to have this part. There, that's what those nubs look like, and this will be the back of it. It's turned off right now. Same thing with this. Open, close. Now, what I did on mine, because I wanted more power, I didn't care about shutting the jets off, because you're going to be overpowered as it is for the amount of jets you have. I cut these tabs right off, and it really gave me a good amount of power. I cut them off, and then I couldn't turn them on and off, so all I did was have the opening in there, because this, this creates back pressure. So same thing, you're going to look in there, it's threaded, be the same thing, take all the jets out, blow it out, make sure your filter's cleaned, blow the lines out, put the jet back in, put the ring in there, get your tool on it, or you're good with tools, you can use two screwdrivers, but you got to be careful, you'll break those nubs off. And then you really got to be good with tools. So tighten it back up. Same thing. This is a directional jet. Open it this way. Close it this way. So that's closed. Open. So if you have jacuzzi jets periodically, depending on how well you maintain your pool, you're going to have to take these out and clean them out. And that's how the two primary jets that we use in our fiberglass pools are going to be taken out and cleaned. If something's not working right, if this doesn't go on or off, 
or if you get water backing out of the air venturi, you know, water backing out when you turn the jets out of where the blower is or where the blower would have been, sometimes there's just a pipe sticking out. Your jets aren't seated right. You got to take them all out again and reseat them and keep redoing it until it works properly. That's how to take care of these jets.